if you got a burnt control board, you got a burnt spot on it, um, could have had a power surge, anything. If one part burnt, it could have got hit by another part. So this is just a quick check feature. This plug right here is at the bottom of the board. And this is for your compressor. And you have three prongs in here. You own this out just like any three phase device. So you go from one pin to another pin, 2.2. And then from the same pin to the adjacent pin, 2.2. So all of them should be reading the same. Uh, so compressor, 2.2. We don't have any legs that's different. Uh, next component would be fan motor. So we're going to check all main components that pull power at any substantial wattage that can cause a failure. Uh, motor, one pin to another, is 9.2. And then that same pin to the third pin should be 9.2. 9.2. Actually, 92.2. Okay, and that checks our outdoor fan motor. Our compressor, the next biggest consumptions of wattage would be follow your white wire back from the bottom of your compressor. This is going to be your crankcase heater, which is going to be energized only below 40 degrees. So we're going to check that for ohms. 2.4 ohms for a crankcase heater of 12,000. And now check it to ground. On one leg, check it to ground on the other leg. Okay, crankcase heater is good. Last component we have is our chassis heater, which is only going to be energized below 40 degrees. So we're going to pull that off and we're going to check it just like the crankcase heater. Put it on one pin to the other pin, and we have 361 ohms now from one pin to ground from the other pin to ground so you should read nothing to ground on any of them and that's it that's the main components test